songs like yes. can you count you know what actually yesterday i was like okay i have the songs i've not released i'm i mean i'm, I'm more than 100 yeah the ones i've not released though but the ones i released i went to check it was like 43 i was like hey, wow 43 when hey so i was in the wow. studio doing all that so i just felt so proud i didn't even know i had this you know mm-hmm oh the number was crazy i was oh. like damn thank god congratulations no I mean, easy, it's not easier women in the industry music and all that but in all of this how are you promoting your music it's tough trust me it's tough but we are still doing we've been doing it for years and you yeah. know i mean the the old ways has been helping i mean mm. and, and plus the people actually loves me so uh, mommy feel it you yeah, know, like a bit okay. I, I don't have to let nobody down. I have to keep going regardless. So mm. I don't, I don't really think of the money or. But if I release a song, if I have to promote, I have to promote. That's that's the mindset for me. Yeah, and you have some some really wild performances. Anytime yes. you find yourself on oh. stage, it's like it's something else. I try. <laughs> I try. <laughs> it's beautiful. But I mean, I asked about promotions because I've I've heard he you talk a lot about it. I mean, the fact that you don't get support. No. I well, me honestly on the street. I know I get a laugh. Mm. I know that because I've, I've I've been performing since you know. I I know the crowd reactions and everything. Yeah. But I don't know what's the why. How do I even say it? Some people people are the one prompting me about that too. Like mm. you are not being loved. You, you are not always, like there's yeah, no love yeah, or support. They use the word underrated all the time with my name. Okay. So I'm like. What what is the problem? Because I feel like the people there, if I release, did they jump yeah. to the song? So where is this whole conversation coming from? Mm. And I don't get this question asked from the normal people. I get I get asked from like the industry industry like, people exactly. that so what's I'm like, going so on. So am I not? Fa- I'm, what's happening? Like you know? So yeah. it, uh, it just but, messes with your head a little bit. But yeah. I know that I'm working. Mm. Like I know that every song that I, I release, the people. Who, I mean. It's not easy for like me being consistent yeah. every time, Charlie. It's not be easy, it's but not easy. the people that in Kofun and Emma, my dream say it's not. It's, it's not, not working. It's not working. But yeah. is there is there something in particular you feel that if people do, uh, it would go to show that that support is there? Yes, I mean, put me on the big stages too. Like, come on, you know, like it's it's sad. Like sometimes when you don't get the link ups and stuff like that, people do like, oh, who I know. Mm. As I say, but and then they they despoil the business, you know. Mm. Uh, it makes like one person be like, "Oh, I'm the only person who has to be here," and the rest is like, "Ah," and they start questioning, "What are you guys doing?" But mm. we are here. We are doing the job. Mm. Put us on, like you know. But it's it, it is what it is in this mm. industry. Would you say that it's because maybe you are you are a woman? Maybe yes. that's why because um I, you have a lot of hits. I exactly. mean, we listen to them, we dance to all of those songs. I've seen you on platforms like the VGMAs. Yes. I've seen you at Ghana Music Awards yes. um, UK. Um, well, I've seen you on other platforms. Mm-hmm. When you talk of big stages, what stages? What what exactly? Where do you want to be? It's got nothing to do with the Ghana stage. The Ghana um, stage, yeah, we've done it. Mm. Oh, but it's like the entire stream. Like let's support us, you know. Ghanaians, mm. if we don't support us on our own, nobody will come support on our own. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. So we just have to just help another. Another. Because yeah. me, I just struggle all the time. Like, mm. I've been saying it countless times. If I sit on, if I'm in my house 24 7, I'm by my computer, I'm in my studio, I'm recording all the time. I need to find a new. Because I. I don't know the only here. So you have mm. to do it. Yeah. But you've also said you've been sidelined. That, the same thing. The people have been saying that so it's not it's not like I came out saying that I've yeah. been sidelined. But, but when it's you like, hear when you hear these people say, do you feel it? Yes, I'm like when for you somebody think about to it. say mm. that I'm sidelined, maybe they have a reason for them saying that. And then it will get to me eventually because I feel like, Oh, then this is the reason why I'm not getting this, this is the reason why I'm not getting that. But for the people there, I know it's so the love they there for me. So that's mm. the reason why I'm always like paying attention to the people, not what people are actually saying. Mm. But mm. the sideline is the people that have been saying it. And I just said I was like, okay, maybe they think I am sideline, so why not? Is it from the industry, from the people? Honestly, on oh God, I have no idea. Where you that have no is idea. From. I'm just doing me basically. Mm. I'm not looking at all those things no more. I'm just mm. doing me. I'm yeah. just doing what I do best. But it, it must have really been. <laughs> it, it must have really been tough for you i mean as a female artist because i know that for some people they try and when it doesn't work they, they quit. easily quit or even give up and i don't I, blame them yeah because we all uh, we all artists have to break down eventually like it's a stressful job especially. have you ever thought of quitting yes 
Oh, multiple times. I say that to people, but now I feel like even me, I've thought of quitting. So there's nothing you have to actually. I mean, if you put your mind on something, you have to not try to not quit because mm. you are going to even hurt yourself. You know, in the longer run, like. Mm. I uh, just just do it. Mm. I feel like you just have to do it. Yes, you are not there yet, but the fact that you're putting in the work, ah, God mm. knows the sleep. Oh, God is watching everything. Yeah, that's true. I I know sometimes people go like maybe perhaps you have. Do you do you think you have issues with people in the industry? I get that too. Me, I'm very like all to myself. You know, I'm just reserved. You know, I like to be in my own space. I don't like to be in people's faces. It could be that because I don't. I'm not the type of person that will be in your face all the time. That's the reason why people would say whatever they want to say about <clears> me. <throat> but I feel like this is who who I am. Mm. Like, whoever feels anything about me, just are you a person. shy person? Used, used to, to be. You used to be. Yes. I, I look at you most of the time, even in videos or sometimes when you have to go somewhere. It's like the moment you stop moving, you just put your head down. <laughs> Am I wrong? <laughs> it's like the moment, you, wherever you find yourself, the moment you have to walk pass anywhere it's like the head goes down and then you walk to wherever it's you have there, to be <laughs> you know vim it is vim that you have been but it's still there it's but. still there oh yeah. mm. something Small that swim. has been with you for years dear it's going to take a long <laughs> time for it to go away <laughs> oh have you been wanting to get married no no hmm no. i mean it's not it's not it's not a conversation i i would want to like it's because serious. you said it before. <clears throat> or oh, you were somebody, joking. I was no no no. Oh it was a joke. Oh oh I get where the conversation is coming from. Mm. But it was a it was a total joke. Hey, it Steph, was yeah. and Abena Moe. Abena Moe was mm. married and I was like, you see her like we were talking about me being in the industry, what advantages and um, I get from it and I was like, But you you're not in the industry, you get married. Do you understand? So <laughs> it was something. it was more like a joke. Yeah, it was oh, more true. Like a, yeah, yeah, bro. Yeah. <laughs> but it's true, it's true. I mean girls in the industry is it's tough, you know when people say it you don't understand unless you're inside like mm. the men are very scared you know they are very careful you know mm. they will just be like oh just because you are you are in the industry that's a problem but me i don't believe in a guy who who says that to me i believe if you like me charlie you like the whole me everything mm. that comes with me so if you come and be like ah because you didn't that she my stories are going to be out there then your mind not correct <laughs> <laughs> oh it's a lady somewhere. i see a man here will he come inside if he's a man he should come please you people should tell the man that if he's a man he should come ah as something in there uh, we are we are all on it but of course i know you have a new song yes please if you have any questions as well you want to ask sister fia you can send them via whatsapp line 0548841039 or you can hit us up on twitter mm -hmm. as well if you have any questions we'll ask her all that here on the show for you but i want us to listen to sister fia's uh, new song carigo. what's the title carigo carigo what did they carigo with the carry we Come, go. Carry, oh, <laughs> you the women head. Yeah. Carry me go. <laughs> wow. So it, it's everything. carry the women go. Carry me go. Carry you Wherever go. Wherever you want to take me. If you your should. mind day. Everything I said in the music. Mm. If you are going to comply. Mm. <laughs> Just go with it. Go with the flow. <laughs> now, if you know Sister Fia, you know that when she releases is something else. Mm -hmm. I mean, she, she's good at it. So let's take a listen to the 